Using sheet metal caps to cover wood or steel sleeper curbs is common, but also one of the biggest mistakes made in commercial roofing. We're going to show you why and what to do instead. The problem with using sheet metal sleeper caps is not with the roofing or the caps themselves. The problem is how equipment is attached. The only way to fasten equipment down is to drill and screw right through the top of the cap, penetrating the watertight barrier. In an attempt to prevent leaks, contractors will use rubber gaskets or caulking, but with the effects of wind and thermal expansion, the fasteners will eventually leak, leading to dry rot, mold, and mildew problems. Dry Cap by Roof Screen Manufacturing solves this problem. Concealed cleats, which are screwed down to the sleeper, act as the anchor to hold the dry cap in place. When the dry cap is installed, short self-tapping screws are used to secure it to the internal cleats without extending through and piercing the roofing membrane. Finally, end caps with sealant are placed on each end. T-slots on the top of the dry cap allow anything to be securely anchored down without penetrating the top of the cap. Any type of equipment, from pipes to air conditioners, can be mounted to the dry cap system. With proper cleat sizing and placement, the dry cap system can resist thousands of pounds of uplift, making it strong enough to even mount a roof screen. The dry cap system is available right now at store.roofscreen.com. Dry cap, a structural sleeper cap system that will never leak.